next tutorial we will learn how to allow remote access to mongodb so this is uh, a kind of uh, demo only so we'll uh, log into one of the server where mongodb is running so my mongodb is running let me close this to right here yeah. so my mongodb server is running on uh, 192.168.1.61 so i'm logged in as a mongodb user and I'll say pseudo system CTL status MongoD. You can see the status is uh, running. So if I say Mongo, so by default, Mongo is uh, configured and installed to allow local connections only. If I say Mongo, so I'm logged into the database server. If I say show DBS, I'll be able to see the databases. And there is another way also if I say Mongo hyphen hyphen host and I mentioned the name host as the local host so I'm um, again logged in I'm trying with the third way so I'll say IP a pipe crap net just checking the IP address of my system it is 192.168.1.61 so if I try to log in mongo hyphen hyphen host and 192.168.1.61 uh, this will show me the error that uh, uh, connection is refused right uh, similarly if i try if it is not able to connect from the local system uh, which is on the same server it will not be able to log in from the remote server this is my remote server and the ip address is ipa pipe grab uh, net so you can see the IP address is 51. So if I try to log in from this server, uh, mongo hyphen hyphen host uh, 192.168.1.61, again, uh, this is connection is refused. So what I will do to allow the connection is, you have to go to sudo vi slash etc slash mongod.conf file and uh, go to uh, bind IP and here in the bind ip you have to mention the ip address of the card of this local system and, and the ip address is 192.168.1.61 so i have added the ip address of the server itself in mongod.conf just restart after uh, uh, making the changes so we'll say sudo system ctl restart mongod so this should restart immediately so this is done just check the status the status is active and running so clear the screen and then we will say mongo hyphen hyphen host and we'll mention the ip address 192.168.1.61 all right so i'm able to log in it is show dbs you will be able to see all the databases so the now next what i'm going to do is i'm going to connect it from the remote server so this is my remote server where um, we already have the mongo shell installed so here we will see say mongo hyphen hyphen host and we will mention the IP address which is 192.168.1.61 just say show DBs and we are connected to the remote server so this is how we connect to the remote server although we have not enabled the authentication wherein you can create a user id admin user id or application user and then you can connect remotely same way but you will have to give the user id and the password i hope this is going to help and thanks for watching